Don Nelson. I'm editor of the Additive Report, and I'm at Fabtech 2019. I'm at the booth of 3DX Tech. I'm with Matt Howlett, who is the founder and president of the company. And tell me a little bit about your company. I, I know you started, what, seven years ago? Yeah, we started, uh, I think it's about five years now. Five years and so the, uh, focus of the, uh, the focus of the business for the last five years has been materials. My, back, my background's in high performance materials, uh, high temperature carbon fiber type materials. And so we created a functional line of uh, filaments that are suitable for a lot of different uh, machines. But over the last year or so, we've transitioned a little bit into being a machine supplier to dovetail in with our high performance materials. And so this is the new machine, the gearbox. What is unique about this? Why did you develop it? Uh, what wasn't out there that, that this what that this fills the need for? Sure. So for many years we've been able to make materials that have great functionality but have a hard time printing because the state of the art in the open source printer market is a little bit lacking. And so we kind of liken ourselves to a very interesting nail supplier in search of a decent hammer. And so we kind of finally got tired of our customers asking the question of what printer do you recommend? And we decided to come out with our own industrial grade high temperature printer. And it's suitable for materials such as you know ABS, but also up to carbon fiber nylon, carbon fiber peak, carbon fiber PEC. And so it's for big industrial um, high temperature materials. So this would be uh, a system that you would have to have some experience 3D printing in order to, to get this. So this wouldn't be like a starter? Well, no, it's, it's also pretty expensive, but what yeah. we've done is we've done a lot of work on the software so that it can be moderately attended. You don't have to have a, a lot of care to take care of it, uh, but it does take some level of expertise to be able to operate it functionally. Sure. Yeah. All right. And what has been the response from your customers? Oh, it's very welcome. So we have a lot of aerospace customers, a lot of industrial customers, a lot of folks here at this type of show would use our materials. But what they've been looking for is a big machine that can go high temp to print specifically aerospace grade carbon fiber composite materials. And that's what we designed this thing soup to nuts to be able to print carbon fiber high temp. Yeah. You just mentioned that being at this show. This show is, uh, the attendees, the exhibitors, they tend to be folks involved with the conventional type of manufacturing. Right. You as uh, someone that's in the 3D printing space, what would you want to tell those people that they should know about additive manufacturing? Well, I think some of the stuff that we do helps streamline their processes of traditional manufacturing. A lot of our customers already do fixtures, jigs, end of arm tooling. Uh, we have a lot of customers in the uh, press break markets and uh, more and more customers in this space are actually starting to buy 3D printers to help inside their metalworking processes. All right, thanks very much, Matt.